seeing you, Batman. Feel free to let yourself out. I can't let Penguin get away. There's more I need to ask him. Deathstroke's device to get up to the balcony. Time to interrogate Deathstroke. The police are already on the scene at Lacey Towers. Looks like I can use the remote claw I took from Deathstroke. GCPD to take a look at the final offer. More to Dixon Docks. They'll find Slade Wilson tied up and waiting for them, along with some of Penguin's illegally obtained weapons. Uh, another anonymous tip? Will do, sir. Oppressed citizens of Gotham, your cries for help have been heard. I am anarchy, voice of the people here to save you from the plague of corruption that now infests this once proud city. Those hired and elected to keep us free and safe won't lift a finger. And why would they? They've been bought and paid for, encouraged to turn a blind eye. If they won't act, I will. At dawn's first light, the sources of Gotham's ruin will be destroyed. Now, back to your regularly scheduled programming of propaganda and consumerist garbage. As if there isn't enough going on tonight. I should hurry to Lacey Towers before the cops destroy all the evidence from the crime scene Penguin mentioned. I was hoping to get a minute of your time. See, I've got a story to tell you about crime and violence, greed and vengeance. But it's also a story of redemption, of second chances, of change. I've planted three bombs where Gotham's corruption is at its strongest. But unlike those I fight to overthrow, I believe in choice. So, I offer you one. Let them detonate, or stop them. Your actions will determine what I do with you. Hey, miss. Over here. I've planted three bombs where Gotham's corruption is at its strongest. But unlike those I fight to overthrow, I believe in choice. So, I offer you one. Let them Whoa, detonate. easy now. I ain't looking for a fight. Got a message, that's all. Anarchy says if you're gonna make a withdrawal, you better do it soon.
I've planted three bombs where Gotham's corruption is at its strongest. But unlike those I fight to overthrow... The cops investigating this crime should have a relay station set up. It'll look like a mobile satellite dish, probably on a rooftop. Twenty. On the balcony for a smoke with a menace. 
Those men on the balcony, that could be my way in. Case. Penguin murdered Black Mask and his lady friend. We found the bastard's stubby little fingerprints right by the body. Yeah, we got Penguin now. I'd like to see him screw him out of this one. Fingerprints, two dead bodies. He's about to do some time. Yeah, except forensics take all the credit. And I'm the one who... believe Penguin murdered Black Mask, but why would he send me here if he was the killer? It doesn't add up. This crime took place days ago. The fire and the exposure to the elements make identifying the victims difficult. The male victim is wearing a black mask but I can't positively identify him as Roman Sionis without a DNA analysis. Something I can't do in the field. I can identify the female victim based on her fingerprints. Tiffany Ambrose, Roman Sionis' girlfriend, or one of them at least. She was no angel, long list of priors, but nothing to indicate she was the target here. The fire spread as a result of a Molotov cocktail thrown into the room. It may have been intended to destroy evidence. The shallow trajectory of the bullet suggests the shooter could be someone of Penguin's height. But the grooves on the floor suggest that the victim was killed by someone leaning back in a chair. This bullet was fired from a revolver. Ballistics analysis indicates a low angle of trajectory. The shooter could have been someone of Penguin's height, but the pattern in the gunpowder residue suggests the bullet was actually fired by someone lying on the ground. These fingerprints are a match for the penguin, but they're on top of the soot from the fire. The cops were right. Penguin was in the room, but these prints prove he was here after the murders were committed. If he didn't kill Black Mask, who did? The only thing I know for certain is that Tiffany's shooter was lying on the floor. But why? These white streaks are shoe polish. Whoever shot Tiffany was being dragged along the floor. Besides the victims, there were two other people in the room. Tiffany's shooter, and whoever was dragging the shooter. The location from which the male victim was shot may tell me more. The DNA here doesn't belong to either of the victims. Whose is it? The fight broke out when someone startled the shooter. It's not clear who won the fight. Could have been either one of them. I should review the evidence to see if I can learn anything more about either the intruder or the shooter. analysis indicates the intruder was wearing a white suit or sport jacket. This fabric swatch could help identify the intruder, but I still can't identify the male victim's shooter. There's one impact area I haven't checked for clues. This DNA is from the female victim. The level of oxidation suggests it's been here for several days. If I review the evidence, I may be able to find out what she was doing when she was attacked.
she was sending text messages to Roman Sionis about someone named the Joker. Someone killed Black Mask. But this crime took place several days ago, and I saw Black Mask earlier tonight. The only answers I have raise more questions. Who is the Joker? Was he the killer here? Or is he one of the assassins? I have a body, an unknown shooter, and an unknown assailant who attacked the shooter. I need to match the DNA samples against the records in the National Criminal Database to identify who was in the room. Alfred, I need access to the National Criminal Database. Well, the only way to do that would be to infiltrate the Gotham City Police Department. Then that's where I'm going. Sir, you'd need to physically hack into their servers. If you insist on doing something that foolish, you'll need a powerful non-lethal weapon. I recommend coming back here to pick up your concussion detonator. Not a bad idea. Welcome home, sir. The concussion detonator is on your workbench. Remember, if you use that instead of your fists, you'll do less lasting damage to those police officers and civil servants. Noted. Well played, sir. You stopped the electrocutioner with a single strike. I just used his arrogance to my advantage. A textbook move a child could have avoided. True, but I doubt the rest of them will go down as easily. If they do, we'll be eating that Christmas ham sooner than you think. easier ways to earn frequent flyer points, sir? Very funny, Alfred. Why, thank you. Just a few more remarks like that, and I'll have earned my spot in the sarcastic butler's Hall of Fame. <laughs> Since when did masks become de rigueur for aspiring crime lords? Some of the assassins have access to rather interesting technology. When this is over, you might want to consider appropriating it. Let some good come of tonight's events.
back here, hmm? Taking a break from tearing up the city? Well, you're wasting your time. This tower's given up all its secrets. Um, at least the ones your limited cognitive capacity allows you to process. Understood. Thanks. I'm upping the stakes, Batman, just like I promised. Tread carefully. Oh boy! You sure showed that crate who's in charge. Stop this. Stop what? Cleaning up the streets? Ensuring the GCPD actually does its job? Removing corruption from the system? Was it one of those in particular you took issue with, or all of them? You're using the data you've stolen to blackmail people. So? It gets the job done. It's certainly kinder than the beatings you're so fond of doling out. Think on that.
Somebody ought to lay boots to him. Show him how we do things in Gotham. Sign me up for that. This won't be easy. But if I'm going to access the National Criminal Database and find out what happened at Lacey Towers, I need to find the server room without being discovered. to ensure order in this city. So our number one priority becomes bringing in the bat before these assassins get to it. Now, the closer it gets to morning, the more desperate the assassins will grow. And if he's still out there, the more damage they'll cause to the city as they try to find or attract him. All right, dismissed. You know, they were supposed to be guarding the crime scene, not Gavin. No wonder the bat got the drop on him. you be so brutal, sir? These are city employees. They're as corrupt as they come, and they're in my way. I wish you'd think twice about that approach, sir. You never know when you might need their help. At any rate, your objective is the GCPD server room. I've marked it on your map. able to access doors like this with my cryptographic sequencer. I'll need to find another way. I won't stand a chance against that many armed men. I can use Deathstroke's remote claw to pass above their heads undetected. 
Alright, listen up. While you jokers were playing cleanup crew at Blackgate, I was making us some money. I've worked out a deal with our pal Black Mask. If any of us can kill the bat before the assassins get to him, we get the bounty. All 50 million dollars. And for those of you who ain't too good with the math, that means we all retire early. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Let's take him down then. Yeah, what are we waiting for? Enough! We only get one night to get this done. So whatever they put you on, I want you to blow it off. I need to silently take down that guard in order to move on. Yes, sir. All clear. Clear as day, sir. You got it. Sir, yes, sir. Sir, what about the assassins? Will they see us as competition? Yeah. They didn't sign up to be on those guys' hit list. Them we treat him like any other scumbag. We can't find dirt. Make our own. I'm listening. What if Captain Gordon allowed me to grab a What does this disruptor of yours do? Little bit of this, little bit of that. Mostly, though, it does a whole lot of none of your damn business. Oh, you want to play it like that? All right. Maybe I'll have the guys over at Evidence Lockup take a look. They can get kind of rough, though. Don't Not you again! <laughs> Talk, or you won't be walking anywhere, ever. No way! You gotta answer for dropping me off that rooftop, buddy! No, you have to answer to me. How does this disruptor work? Ask one of the pigs! They got it in evidence lockup! How about we take a little walk up to the roof? Okay, okay, you win! It, it jams weapons, overrides electronic locks, all right? Now you gotta let me go! How'd that work out for you last time? yourself to a shelter. You kidding? That's where they round us up. Hey, you don't get it. Anarchy gets it, but you? Hey, you don't get it, man.
give this bastard what he wants, he'll send the tape to the press. What the hell am I supposed to do? That's the best you got? How am I gonna whack him if I don't know who he is? Guy's a mystery, complete friggin' enigma. <laughs> yeah, great advice. Thanks. are justified, who acts completely outside the system. The system is broken. Barbara, wait.
Searching your quadrant? Eh, I'll leave that for the boys in SWAT. Why's that? Ain't you hurt? Brandon made a deal with Black Mass. They're trying to kill the bat and collect the. You're coming. Priority one alert. All personnel report to your department head. Need a head count. A lot of people unaccounted for. security protocol I'm not familiar with, and the windows are reinforced glass. Hmm. The disruptor in the evidence locker might do the trick. to an old elevator shaft. That will take you to the evidence locker. Got it. Should be able to bypass the security on the server room door. Priority one alert. Hearing reports of a prisoner disturbance and holding cells. Emergency protocols. 
Disruptor should allow me to get past this gate. They're gonna let us out, but we'll make our own way out! Yeah, yeah! How about that? This ain't such a bad Christmas after all! I got a pulse. I need access to the National Criminal Database. It's right here. You must spend a lot of time here. Cool poem box. You're bypassing the network security. Hmm. But you'll need to physically bridge the intranet to the external telecom wires if you want to uplink remotely. This kind of knowledge could get a young girl into a lot of trouble. They run under the building. What does? The telecom wires. You can access them through the sewers. Wait. Why do you do what you do? Because I made a promise. Get out of here! <laughs>
I'm on my way out, but before I can access the server remotely, I need to hack into the telecom wires under the GCPD. You should be able to access them from the sewers which run below the building. I'll peg the closest entrance on your map. Sir, they say the bat doesn't have a gun. Penguin's man said the disruptor can be used to jam their weapons. It's the bat! Call in 064! you but you need to stay out of my way uh, never listen I'm on your side my side my side works within the law my side doesn't leave suspects with broken bones and missing teeth we've earned Gotham's respect if that were true I wouldn't believe you. Gordon clear the line of fire hold your fire if he moves take him down you've got nowhere to run Move, Gordon! I'm taking him down! on any crates you find. It'll fry their circuits and render the stuff useless.
I've got multiple calls available. Sending them out in priority order. 